ever since I was in fifth grade, uh, and I learned that there's a word for someone that draws buildings for a living, that's what I wanted to be. That dream, launching David Manica worldwide, seeing his vision in San Francisco, Las Vegas, South Korea, Japan, and now the Sooner State. And I can't think of a place that my building would make a bigger difference than Oklahoma City. Passes five to two. Tuesday, city leaders voted to hire Manica and TBS under the same contract to build a new Thunder Arena that voters approved. We, we have always been playing for these last 16 seasons in a really kind of lower tier minor league hockey, you know, facility. But it is outdated now. Manica says he's approaching this with an open mind and blank canvas. To come here with a preconception or a rendering that I somehow did without listening to everybody would be presumptuous and I think very selfish. In a vision session with city leaders after the vote, Manica says the words unique, togetherness, community, outdoor spaces, and of course, the wow factor came to the forefront. And remember, the nearly $1 billion budget must also cover amenities outside the arena, such as parking and landscaping. It's the start of a mission to make every dollar count. This is exactly what I was born to do, is work on buildings like this, in cities like this, for people like this. In Oklahoma City, Caitlin Ogle, Oklahoma's News 4. And Caitlin asked if iconic traits of Oklahoma, like the bison or scissor tail, may be an inspiration in their design. He says he was struck by our red dirt, but that's not to say he's going to design a red building. Manica expects to unveil the design next summer. We'll be sure to show it to you then.